many priests with us. We would like, uh, we will be very happy if uh, Monsignor Isidore comes and gives us a few words. Please. Please.
the government in Syria, in every new agglomeration, expansion of the city, give on the plans two land, one for the Muslim to build mosque, and one for the Christian to build church. But it isn't for for the division of the church. It isn't for the Greek Catholic, it isn't for the Greek Orthodox, it isn't for the Latin, it isn't for the Syriac, it isn't for the Armenian. It's for a Christian. Right. That's for, before that I arrived in, in, in Damascus on 92, the people told me that here on this street there is a mosque, but it was before a land for a church. We didn't take it because we are in division, so the government decided to give it to the Muslim. So the Muslim took two land, one for the mosque and the land for the church because we are not in union together. So we lost a lot of lands and we cannot build churches. So I decided to do something for Damascus. I go to the Greek Orthodox Church to meet the Patriarch and I ask him, Beatitude, why we have to lose lands? Please, we can sign a paper for the government and we begin to take the land. He said, what for? We cannot build church together. I said, maybe we can do it in a few years. Now we decide to take the land. And it was okay. He signed the Greek Orthodox, the Patriarch Ignatius, and the Greek Catholic Patriarch Maximus Hakim, who is died now. We took the land. Now we have to build. The Greek Orthodox said we have no money. <laughs> and the Greek Catholic said, and we be happy. But in true Everybody has money, but we were afraid. We want church, but we, we, without sacrifice. So I said, okay, I need another letter, please. Sign me another letter together. I will find the money in Europe. And I go in Europe, and I took more than $300,000. And we begin the church. It was reality now. But it isn't finished. So we go to the Patriarch Orthodox and Catholic, we said we have to finish. Now we cannot stay like that. So everybody from the Greek Catholic and the Greek Orthodox pay half and half to finish the church. And now the church is finished. It's, uh, we, we begin to, we don't celebrate together. We have two messes on Sunday, one for the Catholic, one for the Orthodox. Because the Greek Catholic and the Greek Orthodox are the bigger community in Damascus. But if other communities want to celebrate a Mass, they can. If they are Catholic, they took the, the, the hour of the Catholic Church. If they are Orthodox, they took the hour of the Orthodox Church. So we can celebrate in the same place. That is a first step for the Union. It's very important. We have two Eastern feasts in Syria, and it's very uh, a bad thing for the church. We didn't testify Jesus Christ in the Muslim when you see us that we have two Easter, two crucifixion, two resurrection. It's too much. We didn't arrive for a solution. We know that the acceptable solution till now that the Catholic celebrate with the Orthodox. The Orthodox cannot move till now. We hope that we, we will move in the future for the, for the solution of the Christian world together. But we think that we have to do something in the next year. Maybe next year, like we begin in the Church of Duma, 
And this year, we don't accept to celebrate two fests in the same church. We celebrate with the Orthodox. Yeah. 